Hey fellow travelers, welcome to Travel Moji. In today's video, together we will explore the top 10 things to do in Cyclades. Before we get into the video, make sure to check out the link in the description for the best way to book a flight at the cheapest price possible. And don't forget subscribe to the channel and like the video and hit that bell icon. Cyclades, located in southern Greece has a picture-perfect setting and is dotted with 39 islands. What is the picture that comes to your mind when we talk about Greece? Golden beaches, azure waters, with the yellow sun rays falling on the waves and making it sparkle. Whitewashed cubic houses, baugandilias, narrow alleys, blue-domed churches, and classy taverns is the perfect picture that comes to our minds when we think of Greece. Well, you will get all of those here in Cyclades. The islands in Cyclades are absolutely alluring and are perfect for you to spend an amazing vacation. With its serene views and fascinating history, these islands are dream destinations for many and it definitely should be in your bucket list as well. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. Number 10. Delos Delos is definitely not a typical island that is too crowded. It is almost an untouched and inhabited island, which is literally a historical treasure. But its beauty lies in its wilderness. The ancient monuments and some statues of Greece are still standing tall here. Also, it is forbidden to spend a night at Delos and there are no hotels or resorts for public stay. Some of the places that you can visit here are the Sacred Lake, the Temple of Delians, Athenians, the Sanctuary of Apollo, the House of Dionysus, Masks, and the Dolphins and lastly, the Archaeological Museum. So if you want to explore the history and see some untouched monuments from ancient Greece, Delos is your place to begin. Number 9. Amorgos If you want to go hiking along some great walking trails, then Amorgos is the perfect place for that. The walking trails from the village of Langata to Timios Stavros Chapel and from the monastery of Chizovaitissa to the village of Potamos are well-renowned all over the world. It is a really great place for hiking and exploring. Other notable spots here include Catapola and Igali, two small and beautiful island ports, the Byzantine monasteries of Panagiches of Atissa, the capital of Amorgos Kora, the beaches of Muros, Aja Anna Cove, Kalatartisha. Amorgos can be a really great place to start your Cyclades tour from. It can really rejuvenate you and give you the boost needed to start this amazing vacation. Number 8. Milos Milos is a volcanic island and the coastline of this island is dotted with tall cliffs, strange-shaped rocks, which juts down the beach water. Milos is greatly developed for mining and has the largest number of beaches and cyclades. The beaches here are spectacular. This includes the beaches of Pravadas, Kyriaki, and a lot more. Other places here include Adamas, Kalma, Tripedi, Plaka, and the Roman Theater. The ferry and boat rides to the beaches are yet another attraction that Milos has to offer. So if you want to explore some alluring beaches, then Milos will offer you a great deal to start with. Number 7. Andros If you can't decide between taking a sunbath and hiking, the two most popular activities in Cyclades, then you can go to Andros. Andros has some really beautiful beaches and some really good hiking trails, varying from easy to difficult ones. You can hire a guide who will tell you everything about this. Some great places to visit while you are in Andros are the Port of Gavrio, where you will find classy tavernas, the hiking point of Apicia the serene resort of Batsy, the beach of Phylos, and a lot more. So, if you want to do multiple activities, the Andros will offer you that. Number 6. Syros 
Syros is the most populated island, yet the smallest in the Cyclades. It is also the administrative capital of the Cyclades. It is one of the most classical islands in Greece. It is the home to several such classical places, which includes the City Hall, Myoli Square, the Theater of Apollo, the main city of Ermupali, and a lot more. The beaches of Finicas, Azalemnos, Laia, Deflini, and Kinney are also ravishing. Syros has a busy city life, and if you want to witness the modern-day lifestyle of the Greek people and compare it with the ancient lifestyle, then Syros is the perfect place to be. Number 5. Naxos. Contrast to Syros, Naxos is the largest island of Cyclades, yet the least populated one. It has some sarin beaches and remote hilltops which are the main tourist attraction here. The best beaches that you should definitely visit while at Naxos are Piagaki, Mikri Vigla, Agiasos, Aja Anna, Kastraki, and a few more. Other than the beaches, the hilltops are a speciality of Naxos. This includes the mountain villages of Philodi, Aparanthos and Halki. So if you are someone who can't decide between mountains and beaches, then Naxos will be a life savior to you, as it has great hilltops and alluring beaches in the same confinement. Number 4. Tinos, if you are a spiritual or mystical person, then Tinos will surely attract you. It is the pilgrimage site for the Greeks and dozens of people come here every year to pray in the Evangelistra churches. Apart from that, it has some other great places to be visited as well. This includes the small yet beautiful beach villages of Pagos, Volax, and Cardian. The beaches at Kalimbrata are also remarkable. Hora, the capital city of Tinos, has the most beautiful and pearly white churches. Panormos is a really great port where you will get authentic Greek food in the traditional Greek restaurants and tavernas. So if you like mythology, then Tinos will be a great place for you. But if you don't, you can certainly enjoy the alluring beaches here. Number 3. Mykonos. If you have a young soul and you like parties, Mykonos will embrace you with its amazing and lively atmosphere. Here the party never stops. The DJ will always be at the beach and renowned musicians are hired to come and play music here. It attracts a major number of tourists every year, which even crosses a million. It has some amazing beach pubs and bars. Apart from that, Mykonos has some of the most beautiful beaches in all of Greece. You can certainly enjoy the lifestyle here, and it's okay to party while you are on vacation. After all, a vacation is all about enjoying. So if you want to attend the best beach parties then Mykonos is the place. Everyone is welcome here. Number 2. Paros. Pyros has some amazing golden sand beaches, some picturesque villages, and has a sense of tranquility in the air. Some amazing places that you can visit here are Perikia, the port of Poso Levati, Nausa, and Lux. You will get an amazing spread of seafood and traditional Greek cuisine here. Near to Paros is the island of Anti Paros, where the main village is serene and you can totally enjoy your day at the beach. So if you want a relaxing trip, Paros can be the best island for you to go. Number 1. Santorini 
Santorini is perhaps the most loved and sought-after island in the whole of Greece. Santorini has some amazing blue-domed churches and the perfectly whitewashed cubic houses and the most serene sunsets of this full world. There are innumerable spots here and you will never get bored in Santorini. The perfect places to visit here include the Caldera, the beaches of Fera and Oya, the Red Beach, the Black Beach, the archaeological site of Akrotiri, and the village of Amuravigli. Santorini is perhaps the best place in Greece, and even though it is crowded, it is worth it. So if you ever go to Cyclades, Santorini is the first island that you should visit. It is absolutely worth it. So, this was the list for top 10 places in Cyclades. Do let us know in the comments which one is your favorite place to visit, or if you want to add a suggestion about some other places to this list. Hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, do not forget to like and share our video and subscribe to our channel.